Hi, I'm Skyler. For some time now on the Mac, I've been using an application called Tags. You can get it from caseapps.com. Here are some of its features. I really love the ability to organize things, to quickly find things. I mean, you get the idea. The best part about it is that it's open meta compliant. So these tags work with everything. Let me give you a quick idea of how the interface works. So I've set my keyboard shortcut to control space in order to open the tagging window. And I can open the tag search window by using option space. So control and space brings up this little window. So if I enter the finder and select a file, control space brings up this. So I can see all of the tags that I've actually ever used down here. And I'm going to start typing in tags. You get the idea. Now if I click Tag Browser, I can start going through all these different things. This is where stuff gets really powerful. Creating a new tag is really simple. These tags are also readable by smart folders on the Mac. So if you create a new smart folder and then create a Okay, so we've got a new smart folder here. We can go down to other and we can select from a long list of things. So what if we want to search for a tag right here, so tags, click OK, and tag matches, there we go. So that's one thing that you could do with smart folders, you can set up date ranges, you can set up all sorts of different criteria so that files tagged with open metadata are able to come in and out of them depending on when you'd like to see them and under what circumstances. So that's one application which allows you to tag files on the Mac. But if you show a little bit of patience, OS X Mavericks will bring that feature to the base level of the operating system sometime this fall. Thanks for watching. I'm Skyler.